Well, we are tracking a lot when it comes to our weather. We broke a record high today. Now a cold front moving on through. We also had a few severe thunderstorms in Mississippi. Now, though, it's just some rain that remains. Take a look at this. We'll take a close look at your radar and you can see that the thunderstorm here is off the coast. It's in the Gulf, so that's the good news. Boothville drying out. In fact, I'll take the lightning off the screen now so you can see the rain a bit better. Some of this now just passing near Lafitte, some more up towards the metro area as well. You can see that moving on through with a little bit more rain activity now passing over Pontchartrain. We are also tracking a bit of rain still moving in from the west, so we're not completely done with the rain just yet. Homa, a few little showers popping up near you as as well. So that's the big picture when it comes to the rain, but the rain's going to come to an end overnight tonight, and that's when the cooler air arrives. So let's talk about the temperatures. Today we set a record high 82 degrees at the airport, so that did break the record of 80 degrees, which was set back in 1974, much warmer than our normal temperature. Our average is 62 degrees, so we were 20 degrees above normal today. Now temperatures are starting to cool on down. Cooler for the North Shore, 50s over in Hammond, 60s for the South Shore, but the wind starting to pick up on the North Shore. It's that cooler northerly northern air that's rushing on in. So 16 mile per hour winds coming out of the north in Bogalusa, 14 in Slidell, 13 in Hammond. So we'll continue to watch as that cooler air moves on in. Overnight tonight, most of us, pretty much everyone, dropping down into the 40s. So the rain will come to an end, and then we cool down and we'll stay breezy. Winds out of the north up to 20 miles an hour at times. Then the breeze is going to stick around tomorrow, and the cooler air will stick around. So the morning's going to start mostly cloudy, but we will become sunny later on in the day. The sunshine's not going to do too much to warm us up, though. Highs will stay in the 50s tomorrow. Add in the breeze coming out of the north, 15 to 20 miles an hour. That will, of course, make it feel even cooler, too, when the wind blows. So a chilly and windy day tomorrow. I know it's hard to wrap our head around sometimes. 80s today, record highs today, but tomorrow, you do need a jacket. You'll need it when you step out the door and throughout the day. Also, in just a couple of minutes at midnight, the small craft divisory kicks into place. That will linger until noon on Tuesday. So that's going to stick around throughout Monday and into Tuesday morning. Temperatures are going to stay chilly through Wednesday. We will stay in the 50s, 58 degrees for your high tomorrow, 56 on Tuesday, a few degrees cooler, and then Wednesday again right around 58 degrees. But then we start to bump up a little bit back into the middle 60s on Thursday. And yes, our average high is 62 degrees, so we will be cooler than average through Wednesday. The mornings will be really chilly, 30s and 40s there for the North Shore 30s and then South Shore 40s Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday morning. From there, though, we do see our rain chances start to come back. That's going to be over the weekend with our next cold front, but overall rain chances don't look overwhelming. So here's a look at your seven day forecast. We're going to stay in the 50s through Wednesday. Try to warm up a little bit until that next cold front over the weekend. We'll be right back.